Hi, we have a nice math and question. X bracket x plus two bracket x plus four bracket x plus six is equal to nine. Here we are going to find out the values of x. So bracket x plus two bracket x plus four bracket x plus six is equal to nine. Here we are going to find out the values of x. So that's the other solution. In the first step, I will going to rearrange this x with x plus six. Now here I will going to expand x and x plus 6 and this x plus 2 with x plus 4. So it will turn into x square plus 6x. Here I am going to use the foil method to multiply both the brackets. So it will turn into is equals to nine. Now I'm going to simplify it. X square plus six x x square plus six x plus eight bracket is equals to nine. Here if you can see carefully we have x square plus six x is common so I'm going to let x square plus six x is equals to p. Now I'm going to plug in p in placement of x square plus six x. So this expression turns to p bracket p where this plus eight bracket is equals to nine. Now we are going to expand it. p square plus eight p is equals to nine. Next, I am going to take this 9 to the left hand side, p square plus 8p minus 9 is equal to 0. Here, this equation is in the form of quadratic. So, first, I am going to try to factorize it. So, here, this will turn to p square plus 9p minus 1p minus 9 is equal to 0. From both these terms, I am going to take common of p, p bracket, p plus 9 bracket, where 1 is common, p minus minus plus 9 bracket is equal to 0. So here we have p plus 9 and p minus 1 is equals to 0. So here we get the two cases. P plus 9 is equals to 0. P minus 1 is equals to 0. P is equals to negative 9. And here P is equals to 1. So I will going to solve this one. Here I will going to recall x square plus 6x is equals to 8 is equals to p. Here I am going to take the first case that is negative 9. So the value of case 1 for p we have x square plus 6x is equals to negative 9. In the next step I am going to take this negative 9 to the left hand side so it will turn to positive 9 is equals to 0. Now, this is in the form of a equation. So, I will going to first factor this equation. So, it will turn to x square plus 3x plus 3x plus 9 is equal to 0. In the first step, I will going to take common of x, where x is remaining plus 3, x we took common plus Three I are going to take common axis remaining plus three three times three nine is equal to zero. Here x plus three and this means x plus three is equal to zero. So I can write this in this form x plus three over to power two is equal to zero. 
Now I want to remove this part. So I was going to take x plus 3 is equals to plus minus root 0. x plus 3 is equals to the root of 0 we have that is 0. So the value of x we find out that is negative 3. Now I will going to use the case 2 value that is 1. And I will going to recall our expression x square plus 6x is equals to p. So the value of p we have for the case 2 that is 1. Next, I will going to take this one to the over left hand side. So x square plus 6x minus 1 is equals to 0. Here we cannot take out the factor of this. So I will going to use the quadratic formula here. That is. Here we have A, B, and C. Now I'm going to plug in this A, B, and C value. So this one can be minus 6 plus minus. 6, 6 times is 36, minus minus plus 4 over 2. Here, this will turn to x is equals to minus 6 plus minus root 40 over 2. Minus 6. Here, I will going to take on the LCM of 40. 2, 20 times. 2, 10 times. 2, 5 times and 5, 5 times. So here we, we get the pair of this 2. I'm going to take this uh, pair of 2 outside. That is 2 and root 2, 5 times give you 10 over 2. Now I'm going to simplify it further. x is equals to minus 6 plus minus 2 root 10 divisible by 2 divisible by 2 and this and this get cancelled by 3 this and this value so it will turn to x is equals to minus 3 plus minus root 10 now here we get the two value of x that is minus 3 plus root 10 x is equals to minus 3 negative root 10 value of x we find out that is the first value of x that is minus 3 and then minus 3 plus root 10 and the third value of x we find out that is minus 3 minus v this is our final answer Thank you. Thanks for watching our video. If you do not subscribe to my channel, please do subscribe to my channel.